Russian lawmakers recently said that BRIC nations are in the process of creating a new payment established on a strategy that does not defend the dollar or the euro. And I was wondering if you could uh, confirm that, if you have talked about this with your BRIC colleagues here at the UN. And it was interesting because this news just came days before South Africa sent senior officials to Russia to quote unquote recalibrate the global order. Can you talk about this recalibration of global order that we hear from Russia so often these days? Thank you. Uh, we've been talking about the need to uh, uh, to delink us from the uh, dependence on dollar. Uh, uh, another foreign Western currencies, long time. Uh, and uh, that is not just an issue for Russia, but for many other countries, because we know, we, you know what happens after, after uh, EU, US, and some other countries introduced, uh, introduced uh, how they call it, health sanctions against Russia. It didn't help them much, but, uh, but it tells us that uh, they are not reliable. Their financial system is not something that we can rely upon knowing that they, uh, at any time they can switch off uh, or rather uh, swift off the international uh, payment system, uh, that uh, dollar transactions uh, are not reliable anymore. They uh, sanction the dollar itself because now the dollar cannot travel to Russia officially. Uh, so we have to find ways uh, how to... Uh, how to move to a new system of uh, of exchanges with countries uh, that are friendly to us, and uh, we need to find. Uh, to f uh, th this trend has started uh, not with 22nd of February 2022. We've been speaking that we need to de-dollarize the world economy before it, and we want uh, we want uh, to involve uh, local currencies. Uh, uh, countries' currencies uh, more within the trade with Russia. Uh, we do it successfully with uh, uh, China, with, with other countries. Uh, we need to, uh, to come off that, uh, uh, that uh, uh, narcotic, uh, narcotic needle uh, that the dollar represents. Uh, South Africa senior officials coming to Moscow to discuss uh, the new uh, the new configuration of the world order. That, that uh, dialogue goes a uh, long time already. Now it intensified with the current events and BRICS, which South Africa is a member of, is an active participant in these discussions. And of course, uh, BRICS countries uh, like China, South Africa, uh, Brazil, India are elements of this new world uh, polycentric order that is emerging. So I see nothing nothing criminal or suspicious in, in, in South Africa, Africans traveling to Moscow to discuss this issue. We, we discussed these issues with the BRICS countries and uh, in, within the Shanghai uh, Cooperation Organization in other formats uh, regularly.